Hey, Fab Girls. Today, I'm having a no makeup day, as you might notice. And in this video, I'm going to tell you why I love having no makeup days every once in a while and how you can look really beautiful with little or no makeup at all. If you're new to my channel, welcome. I'm Tracy Gold, and it's my absolute passion to bring you fashion tips that make you look and feel fabulous. At the end of this video, I'm going to be doing a subscriber giveaway competition. So if you haven't already, please feel free to subscribe to my channel so A, you can get tips, and B, then you're eligible for the prize. Stay tuned for a little bit later in the video when I tell you the details of what I'll be giving away. Right, let's get stuck into the tips. Now, why no makeup days and why is it important? Well, for me, I like to have no makeup days every once in a while to give my skin a break from makeup. On these days, I usually tend to do a little bit of extra skincare. Give my, my skin a little bit of a massage, put on some extra moisturizer, serums, etc. And it just means that my skin is in better condition in the long run, which means hopefully I'll look younger and better for longer. Secondly, I think makeup needs to have its rightful place. I believe that makeup is there to enhance women's natural beauty, and I love it. I mean, don't get me wrong, I love makeup, but I think it needs to be an enhancement rather than a mask that we wear. So I find on the no makeup days, especially when I'm feeling good about not wearing makeup, it just reminds me of that and keeps it in perspective. Thirdly, if you are going to have a no makeup day and you still want to look and feel fabulous, wear a color that makes your complexion pop. That makes a huge difference. If you're wearing a draining color, like black, for example, or a color that just makes you look like you, are, you really are tired, then you're going to look more tired. And the fact that you're not wearing makeup is going to make it look worse. However, if you wear a color that makes your complexion pop, you need less makeup anyway, and you'll still look fabulous. And hey, if you're enjoying these tips, then please feel free to like this video and share this with your friends. You may have plenty of girlfriends who really need to hear that they too can look and feel fabulous with wearing none or a little bit of makeup. So sometimes I also like to do less makeup days. So maybe I don't feel like having no makeup, but a little bit of makeup would be fine too. Now, don't get me wrong. If I'm presenting a workshop or filming, as you will know, or I'm seeing a client or something like that, then I obviously wear makeup because I want to make the effort to look good. And look, that is my job. And I love doing that. That's absolutely fine. On the other days, I like to keep it a little bit natural. So what are my essential go-to products? Well, for me, I really like just a few things. So a um, tinted moisturizer, which I really enjoy because that just keeps my skin moisturized and looking fresh, but it's not necessarily a foundation. Look, I can do this and I don't need huge amounts of coverage, so it works well for me. Um, and I apply it with a, uh, with a brush. Listen, it really does make a difference. And yes, I do do it on my neck as well. Um, in fact, my neck is where I need most of the coverage. Uh, it's hereditary. I just have a wrinkly neck. So I do a little bit of that and I apply with a brush. It gives it a much more even look and also makes the product last a lot longer. Then my eyebrows tend to go woo all around. So I particularly like these eyebrow gels and it just keeps mine in place. Oh, and I do tint, I do tint and tint my eyelashes and my eyebrows because I am very pale. It also means that I can get away with wearing less makeup on my no makeup days and very little makeup days and even my lots of makeup days, like when I'm filming. Oh, filming, as you can see, not so kind with no makeup. I love mascara because I have long eyelashes and curly ones at that, but you wouldn't know it unless I've got some mascara on. But also, 
tint helps a lot if you are pale. And then, you know, I quite like a little bit of cheek, just a bit of color in my cheeks. Although if I'm wearing this color, one that really makes my complexion pop, I find I need less of this. Um, I love these two-in-one kind of products. I really find them useful, really quick and easy. And then I either just use a um, nude lipstick or a lip balm. I've actually got a little bit of lip balm on. Okay, there we go. There we go. There is my little bit of makeup day and I'm feeling and looking fabulous. What are your so basic products? And they may vary from person to person according to the kind of skin that you have and how you feel about your skin. So for example, you may want to use a corrector concealer underneath your eye because you have dark circles under your eye and that one product on your little makeup days will make a big difference to how you look and feel. Or you may just love wearing a bright red or pink lipstick and very little else. Or maybe foundation is your go-to product that gives you a nice even skin tone and makes you feel fabulous and then you leave the rest a la naturel. So ladies, I encourage you to have a no makeup or little makeup day and see how you feel. Maybe you have them on a regular basis and you can share with us as a community how you feel and how it makes you feel as a woman. Or do you tend to wear makeup all the time and nobody ever sees you without makeup? Maybe now is the time to give it a try. Right, ladies, now is the time for the giveaway. The prize is a one hour online image makeover session with me. And because it's done on Skype or FaceTime, it doesn't matter where in the world you are, you can enter. So you will have a one on one with me giving you personalized tips on how to dress for your body shape, how to style your look, whatever questions you may have. In fact, you may have a list of questions from previous videos and you'd like those answered. Whatever it is, that hour is yours, which is exciting, right? So how do you enter? First of all, you need to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And then you need to like this video and comment. Tell me what you like, what you would like more of, whatever you want to comment, feel free to do so. Now, I'm going to be holding this competition from now until the end of August 2017. So you can enter multiple times. So as many times as you comment on one of my videos, okay, obviously one comment per video, but if you go and comment on all of them, then that's fantastic. You have multiple entries. So you can enter as many times as you like. Also, if you think your friends would like to win this competition, feel free to share this with them so that they too can enter. Also, just to say that I will be announcing the winner at the end of the competition after the end of August. So stay tuned for more. Thanks ladies for watching this video. I hope you found it useful and inspiring to try some no makeup or little makeup days every once in a while. I would love to hear from you. What do you like? And maybe what would you like to hear more of so that I can make sure to bring you fashion tips that make you look and feel fabulous. Till next time. Image again.